And Jason, this might be the first microphone that I've ever seen, not only that doesn't have an XLR, mm. but it doesn't even talk audio. No, it doesn't speak analog audio at all. This is the ATND971 from Audio Technica, a boundary microphone. Boundary microphones not terribly thrillingly interesting in and of themselves. Unless but you've got like this a conferencing one, application. Yeah, this one, Cat5, that's it. There is no analog output on this microphone. So how can this be? Okay, so this is one of the, the first microphones on the market that just outputs Dante. And that's all it outputs. But uh, also outputs uh, a bit of control through the capacitance switch on the front. That's cute. So there's a couple of different ways to actually uh, set up and operate this. Now the first of which, the, the simple one, there's a bunch of uh, small switches you can press on the back where you can set gain to either plus 30, plus 40 or plus 50 dB. Or you can put uh, the switch on the front into two modes, so either on and off. So that's what we are at the moment by default. Red is off, green is on. Or momentary. Yep, or push to talk, basically. Um, there's also an 80 hertz low cut, which you can engage. Now, what gets interesting is that you can hook this up. Now, at the moment, of as of the recording of this video, uh, Biamp's Tessera software, uh, Bose's Control Space and Symmetric Simnet Composer can all control this microphone remotely, That's where they cool. can fiddle with a lot more of it. And mm -hmm. then what you can do is you can actually set that button to do pretty much anything you want in your control space. So it could control a PTZ so camera, push the button, zoom the camera, zoom the, the camera, to the turn speaker. on the thing, make the you know the screen come down from the wall. You know, pretty much anything you want. Yeah, and so it runs off a PoE switch. As you can see, we've got a little PoE switch here, and we've just got this running via mm -hmm. Dante Virtual Sound Card into my laptop. You can probably see that it's got some level showing up there as we mm -hmm. as we chatter along. Yeah. Um. So as in a very easy setup. Extremely easy. Plugged it in and it worked. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't actually get much easier than that. Almost like analog, actually. Kind of like plugging in a microphone, really. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I didn't even have to turn on the 48V switch. So, no, no. No. So there we go. Um, yeah, so uh, optimal pickup area, it's cardioid condensers, about 60 degrees in front, so pretty much what you'd expect. And I like that you can, you can wall hang it thanks to these two little yeah. two little attachment points yeah. there. Now, the thing I would say though, I think we're going to need black Cat5 cable if we're going to be sticking these things in everywhere. Because uh, I don't think the blue is going to look very nice on my boardroom table. How about yours? I think so. <laughs> okay. So it'll be interesting to see how many more manufacturers start going down this road. because. The cabling's cheap and easy, the setup's cheap and easy. If you're in the DSP environment, just clicking around things and deploying microphones everywhere becomes very, very easy. And mm. then you've got the control element on top. And, and it gives you the scope as well, I suppose, to, to do big, like much larger scale, mm. you, know, you know, you tie rooms together and things like mm. that mm. much more easily than, than in the past, you know, sort of one cat five cable now yeah. will and that's not even without getting getting into the possibilities of having you know Dante Vector Soundcard or Dante Via um, routing, recording, moving audio around. Um, you know, and if it is a, a corporate environment, you know, you've got Dante, with Dante Via on, on on your computers, and then you know the microphones being Dante. Everything is just a really simple matter of somebody sitting in an office somewhere and just plugging everything together, and we don't really have to worry about analog audio connections anymore. Mm. It's pretty amazing. You just have to worry about what you say in the boardroom because <laughs> you never know who's listening. Every mic is always on and we are recording you. Thank you so much for watching Gearbox. If you like what you saw, please give us a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more videos, don't forget to subscribe to our channel by clicking below. We'll see you next time.